Hi everybody. In this short video, we would like to show you the integration between Rational ClearQuest with Atlassian Jira using Covair Omnibus. The demonstration flow we'll be using in this video, it starts with ClearQuest where we will create a new change request as if it is coming from the customer. And using Covair Omnibus, that particular change request will be replicated to Jira. In Jira, the developers will be looking at that particular change request and modify that, change the status to reviewed, for example. And then they will implement that change request. When that has been implemented, say there is a new bug created in Jira and that bug will be linked with the replicated change request. Now using the same Covair Omnibus, that bug will be replicated back to ClearQuest, not only just the bug but also all the changes made in the change request will be also synchronized back to ClearQuest and also the linking between the bug and the change request will when go back to ClearQuest. So that is the kind of demo flow we'll be using in the actual demonstration. I'll strongly recommend you to see our short video on introduction to Com Covair Omnibus integration platform. That will give you an overview of the technology itself. Okay, now we have these two tools in front of us. On the left hand side, we have the ClearQuest. On the right hand side, we have Jira. So let's start with the ClearQuest. Let me maximize this. The first thing we would like to do is to create a change request in ClearQuest. Let me go to new item, uh, item screen. The first thing we have to do is select a project. So let's go and list out all of our projects and we'll select this AMS Outlook integration. Okay, the next thing is the headline, which is a brief description for this change request. So let me call it change request created in ClearQuest. Just to specify where was it actually created. Let's select this type here, which is of the type change request, and also the severity, which is, let's say, critical. We'll also copy this particular headline and copy it as part of the description. Okay, so we are done with creating this change request. Let me save it. Okay, now let's go back to our list here and let's see. This is our change request newly created. All right, so we are done with the clear quest. Let's go to our Jira now. So this is Jira and in Jira, what we'd like to do is basically see that whether our Clear, uh, clear quest change request has been replicated to Jira or not. Okay, so here we see that our change request has been replicated from clear quest to Jira. So let me open this up. So this is the detail of that particular change request. As you can see, the type is change request as defined. The severity is critical as defined. Here is the description, right? The same one. Now we'd like to edit it. So let's go to the edit screen here. And what we'll do, we'll edit the summary, which was same as the headline in ClearQuest, and we'll call it modified in Jira. We'll also change the request status from new 
to reviewed. Okay, so these are the only two changes I want to make, for example, and then let me save it, update this change request. So the, my change request is now changed and it shows that the request status is reviewed as well as the heading is now modified in Jira. Now let's go back to our list once again. Now what we'd like to do is, so let's go back to the list and here is our change request. Now what we next want to do is create a new bug. And here we go to the create issue and this is the same project we are working on and the issue type is bug. So we are creating a new bug here. So we'll call it a bug created in Jira. Okay, and let's put, uh, for example, the severity, let's put it as critical, and also copy this uh, summary to the description. Okay, I think that's it. Uh, this also shows the issue type is of the type bug. And now let me create this. Okay, so my, my bug is created. It shows that the type is bug. The severity is critical. Here is also the description. Now the next thing I'd like to do is to link between this bug to the change request. For that, I go to this more action section and there is link and I'm linking between the bug to change request, bug to CR. And we can select the change request by doing this. And here is our change request, which is actually modified in Jira as you can see. And let me select that. And let me link it. So as you can see now, in this issue link, it shows that bugs to change request link and the link, this bug is linked to my change request which was originally created in ClearQuest but modified in Jira. Alright, so we are done as far as Jira is concerned. Now we can go back to our ClearQuest. So we are back to ClearQuest. Let me refresh my ELM request and let's see what's happening here. Alright, as you can see here that our change request has come back from Jira to ClearQuest and it shows that this is modified in Jira. So if you, if I scroll it to the right, it shows that actually the review status is now shows reviewed, right? And so both the changes we have made with respect to the heading modified in Jira as well as to the request status from new to reviewed are shown here. Similarly, we also see that our bug, which has been created in Jira, is also replicated. It shows the type is of the type defect, though it was called bug in Jira that is mapped to the type defect in ClearQuest. And this also shows all the other items. For example, the severity is critical, the request status is new. All right. Okay, let me refresh it once again, this LM request, and let me show you that now this bug and the change request are now linked. So here we see that the bug and the change request are now linked here. So if I go to the bug detail here, here is the detail of the bug, all the field values are shown here, and if we go to the related records here, it shows that this is linked to our change request, right? Uh, similarly, if we go to the change request and if we go to the related records here, it shows that like, this is linked to the bug. So basically what we have just shown you is that all the changes made in Jira to the change request has come back to ClearQuest as well as the newly created bug in Jira is also replicated to ClearQuest not only that, also the linking between the bug and the change request, which has been created in Jira, is now also synchronized back to ClearQuest. So Covier Omnimus not only synchronizes and replicates the data from one tool to another tool, but it also synchronizes the relationship, the linking 
between different objects in one tool to another tool.